Elf City Scan, a master clue step that can be really frustrating if we just run around the place without a route, simply because there are 8 clans in such a big area. In this video, I'll show you a step by step guide on how you can cover all scan locations in Prif efficiently with minimal teleporting and running. First, we need a map. As usual, I went ahead and did clues until I have screenshots of all scan locations. This is so that we can have a map that is as precise and drawn to scale as possible, because many times it's that one square that we didn't walk that caused us to miss the scan. Next, we need a route. And of course, we need you. Here, I will explain what the symbol means. But first, for this guide, I highly recommend getting the Attuned Crystal Teleport Seed. This item gives you unlimited teleports to all 8 clans in Prif, and you can get that by AFKing a few hours at hubs. Definitely worth it. If you don't have it, you can use the regular teleport seed or the Master Camouflage Outfit, but I strongly recommend you get the Attuned Crystal Teleport Seed. Okay, the first symbol is you and your meerkats. I strongly recommend using meerkats for all scans because they increase your scan range by 5. And the scan range in this video is based on what you will have when you have the Merkat summon. Next, we have your scan range, which is closely tied to the Pulsing Ring mechanic. I have covered this previously in other videos, which I will link in the description, but for people who have never seen them, I will explain it again because it's a crucial element in this guide. Basically, every time when you have a scan clue open, there will be Pulsing Rings under your character, which increases in intensity depending on how close you are to the clue. There are three levels. The first level is what we call single ping, and it sounds like this. It means that the clue is more than 2 times the scan range away, and in this case, it is outside the yellow box. The next level is what we call the double ping, which sounds like this. When you hear this, it means that the clue is less than 2 but more than 1 scan range away. In this case, it is inside the yellow box and outside the red box. The last level is the triple ping, which sounds like this. When you hear this, it means that the location is within your scan range and you will be able to see the arrow flashing on your minimap. In this case, it is inside the red box. Okay, let's get back to the map. The next few symbols are very intuitive, just a start point and scan routes. The situational scan routes means that you only scan them when you get the double ping. And don't worry if it's confusing now because it will make sense when we animate a character. Okay, let's get to the fun part. I'll show you how you can cover all scan locations in a step-by-step -step manner. First, you start at Trahan by teleporting there using your teleport crystal. And as always, when doing scan clues, you always look out for triple ping. And if you're lucky, your scan location could be found already. If instead, you get double ping, the location could be south, west or northeast of Tra. One point to note is that the location close to the northeast border may not double ping depending on the exact location you land when you teleport to Tra. So from here, you scan the closer locations first by following the green path. But what about the other two locations near Christ? Actually, if you pay attention to the double ping as you run, you'll be able to tell whether or not the location is there. So what do I mean? Because as you're running south, you're moving further away from them, and if the double ping stops midway at around here, it means that the location is at Christ, so teleport there and complete the step. Okay, let's get back to Tra. If there are no double ping or triple ping, it means that the location is outside of the yellow box. So from here, teleport to m -Lot. Again, watch for triple ping here. And if the location is at Hefin, it's faster if you teleport there instead of running. If instead of triple ping, you get double ping. The location is northeast of Hefin, and you guessed it, teleport there and get a scan. If luck is not on your side, and you don't get triple ping or double ping here, it means that the location is near Christ. So teleport to Christ to get the last few locations. If you don't get triple ping here, the location is north of Mayer and follow the blue path to get it. And there we go! All locations covered with only 3 teleports and minimal running, which in total should take you less than a minute. I 
I hope you find this video helpful. These types of videos always take me a super long time to make because I have to map them out first and test the routes from different angles to make sure that they are accurate. So if you like this type of videos, consider leaving a like and subscribe for more. That's all for this video, I will see you in my next one and happy clue hunting.